Well folks, what you're looking at now is a Loch Allen to fish in this ferry. I'm standing in Loch Allen, the rain's come on. I'm going to explain why I'm in Loch Allen and where it is. Where it is is just off the sound of Mull, the island of Mull, which is over there. Through the, the clouds and the mist, a wee bit of sunshine. And how you get to it, you drive up to just short of Fort William. Take the Corrin Ferry, it takes about two minutes. You turn left, 32 miles later, find yourself in Loch Allen. The reason I'm here is a wee nostalgia trip. About 30 years ago I was here, we had a big dig, big gully, a wee gully. A wee gully, of course, is now a big gully. So, gully, if you see this one, so I'll take you back, son. Back in the day, the Armadale Youth Club joined forces with the Loch Allen Youth Club, had a wee swap. Some people from Loch Allen stayed in Armadale, vice versa. And a lad from Loch Allen was repaying the favour to me today, even though he stayed at Big Gully's back in the day. Let me let me stay his for the last two nights. Malcolm McNeil, nice lad Malcolm. He owns a, a boat, takes the divers out. Yesterday I was happy enough to go out with him. He was out the whole day, divers were diving left, right and centre. And I just about regained my sea legs about midnight last night. It was a long day in the ship, or a boat. What do you call it? Anyway, we need a stomach to trip here. This is for Big Gully. If I know, Big Gully wasn't he? Wasn't he? Staying here. He was with Malcolm. It's for Colin Gilbraith, Ian Gray and myself. This is where we this is where we stayed back in the day. We never got into anybody's house. We got the old scout hut. There it is. Still standing after 30 years. But seemingly it's getting demolished shortly. I don't think it's changed in the 30 years we were here. Well, I do remember though the, the scoutmaster, a nice guy called Alec Douglas. Alec sadly passed away in 1994, only 49. I took a wee walk up to the cemetery here. I'm surprised to see it was so long ago and he was so young. Nice lad. I think it was him that brought the, the Loch Allen crew down to Armadale. Yeah, great time. We're out canoeing. Well, see, we were out canoeing. I bottled out of it. See, I remember Big Doug out in a canoe. Young, young Gully out in a canoe. I bottled it. I'm a good deed for the day. Back in the day, 1979 or whenever it was. Some old elderly gentleman was doing that help with a wheelbarrow up yonder hill. Look at it. All the way up to the top. There's a photograph of me halfway up it, shoving the barra. This is what a guy I was. Young, fit and able. He's struggling to push a wheelbar up there, now I can tell you that. I was wondering where all the cars are coming from, but of course, they're coming off the fish nish ferry. There's somebody I know from down our way, originated in Loch Allen. And similarly, her uncle has a plaque <coughs> placed in his name. I think it's down this wee track here, so let's go and see if I can find it. I bumped into it last year years ago. Just so happened she came from Loch Allen. She now stays in Falkirk. She had mentioned to me about this plaque, so I'm going to see if I can find it. Oh, there it's there. I do believe I see a plaque, folks. There you go, in memory of Peter Douglas. 1940, 2006, no one did more for the community of Mordor. And Peter is Alec Douglas's brother. He's got last earlier on. Two great men in the village. So there you go. Back in the day as well, we had a five a side tournament. Myself, Gully, young Gully, Ian Gray, and a girl, girl for Armadillo called Linda Mackay. Linda was in goals for us. We took on five youths of Loch Allen. Gave them an off a horse and that was back in the time. That was back in my prime, 17-18. Just kicking into the, the football. I was right into it then. But Linda Mackay was next to the man of the match, or the woman of the match. <laughs> I remember fearless, fearless diving at people's feet. Big Gully asked me to mention that. He 
this is the field of dreams still here. Field of dreams is where we play the game, it's a way up yonder hill. Gilly, it's not changed in 31 years, mate. Not changed at all, it's still the same goalposts. <laughs> <laughs> still the same nets, they're all 40 pieces. So there you go, I mean, nostalgia trip. Good to see the scout up still there. Loch Allen's door is still there. There's not a thing changed in 30 years. 31 years. We're, we're not really sure when it was we were here, but it's, it's back then anyway. Loch Allen. Yeah, check that out in your Google, folks. Well worth a wee visit. If only to get the, the ferry across the mall. And you can get the, the bus up to Tobermory. It's well worth a visit as well. So there you go, from Loch Allen and the Fishnish Ferry.